Chronic Broccoli here to find out the best Minecraft Hunger Game server as we enter into 2023. We have Miming Club, Lux MC, Universal Craft, Hypixel, and hopefully Mineplex to check out and figure out which one's the best. First up, we have Lux MC. And this one felt like normal Hunger Games, except they stole everything from every server they can think of. The hive thing where you can't open chest with your sword out. And rods, TNT from like the Nexus or Hypixel. Rods were impossible to find too. You see me crafting some here, cause I just could not find any. I had to do it for two games. It was a struggle. The PVP on this server is also just a, a teensy bit janky. What the fuck is he doing? Like, look at me hitting him and nothing happens, and then it finally starts to happen. And also, I did not play a deathmatch without a team. That, that, that was a struggle. The TNT on this server was pretty fun, and not like, like some servers I've experienced. I'm looking at my place. But, yet again, there, there's a lot of teams. That, that's the main issue for this server. Also, the queues take a little bit to load up, which, if you're impatient like me, might be an issue. But other than that, it's, it's a pretty good SG server. It feels a little bit like classic SG, just a lot more janky, and a lot of the maps are tiny. Next up, we have Hypixel's Blitch SG and all their nice kits and kill effects and nice potions off spawn and stuff like that. And also, I'm not a big fan of their PvP. I'm not gonna lie, this is gonna be me mostly hating on Hypixel. I'm a Hypixel hater. Like, why does he have cows teleport into him? What did those do? Except for, for people with bad computers make them lag. Also, the player quality on Hypixel is a little questionable. I was a little bit confused what this guy was doing. My, my favorite part of Hypixel might be not knowing how I died. Oh, no milk does not work. What the fuck was that? I'm not gonna lie. This, Wait, this is one of my favorite one? Hunger Games. Wait, am I fucking his ass up? I'm fucking his ass up. I fucked his ass like, up. I just killed someone with a fishing rod. That, that's a little confusing. He wasn't ready for the speed. The speed is too OP. You get that kill, and then there's the realization. What the fuck? This does more damage than what I have? I'll never understand. And then I'm stuck for a minute there, and we go in. This poor man's. And then the high pixel PvP just feels so weird. He he hasn't been taking knockback, and then all of a sudden he takes all of the huh? knockback, and he's on the other side of the bridge. Watch me choke this kill too. Give me my kill. Oh, 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 okay. I, I will say it, it is a little bit of fun smacking players around with a pickaxe though. And that's the one positive it has. It's deathmatch arena is also pretty, pretty small. Whoa, 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 that's a lot of damage. This was embarrassing. I, I choked you pretty hard choke here. You. We're gonna blame we it choke. on the speed push. Now we have Universal Craft. Now this one, they tried to emulate Hypixel. It's it's a Spanish server. Uh, the loot is a bit more overpowered than Hypixel though, if you can see the diamond sword I got from a random chest and uh, four ender pros in my inventory. Also that guy's diamond chest plate. Also there, there's this one uh, sword that lets you put them on fire, which is pretty overpowered. The potions are fun. It's like a pretty fun version of Hypixel's blitz. And the PvP feels a little bit better than a high pixel, which is not saying much. Being that I don't know. Also, th this is just here to show off how overpowered the power one bow is on this server. And you can see when you get poisoned, it's not, it's not magic. They don't have like any magic things like that on this. Just just some six normal stuff. It is oh, if you can okay, see like the little is. L in front of this guy's user. It's team of two SG though, which is a bit weird. And there are a couple of things that I straight up just don't understand because I simply do not speak Spanish. Yeah, and now you're about to witness the, the downfall of the team 2 SG. I, I don't suggest playing this alone, I'm not gonna lie. The death match is just a glass box. Next up we have Mindplex, and I feel like everyone played on this server at some point, but now it's it's dead. Just absolutely dead. Sorry to see. 
last but definitely not least we have Mineman clubs sg now this is my personal favorite just because it has all the old school maps the chests are tiered instead of randomized so you gotta remember roots and everything and you're only allowed a team of two and you cannot team in deathmatch which is a bonus people still do it anyway but just having that rule there is kind of nice because running into a team of two in deathmatch and just getting pushed into a corner is not always the funnest thing the pvp on this server is actually really smooth because i mean it's a practice server but the only issue is that it's a practice server so for your average player the players are a little bit sweaty so that might scare away some casuals but the sg is actually super just basic on this server they, they really try and emulate mcsg with the maps just everything except the lightning doesn't work so the games last a little bit long because there's not really a way to find any players but when you do find them it's fun as shit